like a rhinestone cowboy. Dun, dun. What's up, Dark Souls 3 crackheads? Today I'm going to be showing you how to kill the Vort boss, whatever his name is. Vortity, Vort, however you say it, whatever. Fort of Boreal Valley. We're just going to roll with that. It sounds good enough. Holy shit. What is wrong with your face, dude? Hold on, I'm gonna have to rewind that. You just look at this guy's nose. Damn, you are an ugly mother trucker. Holy shit. So this boss is fairly easy. He's at the beginning of the game. And since my channel is all about Dark Souls, we're gonna be making YouTube tutorials for every single boss fight. Let's kill this annoying guy right here real quick. I'll show you a little easy strategy I figured out. Now this one's pretty simple. Uh, basically, what you're going to do is instead of trying to dodge all of his attacks, you just want to roll in between his legs. He does a couple of charges at you. If he's away from you, like at a distance, he'll jump. And then all you have to do is keep rolling forward and go under his legs. And then you will just swing your sword or do your little magic. You can shoot him right up in the butthole right there. Oh, yeah. Right in the butthole. butthole. I'm just pushing up on him, pushing up on him. He can't hit me. And uh, once you get your distance back like this, he'll crouch down. He'll look at you, jump. And if you roll forward, you should end up right behind him or right under him. And you can get a couple shots in on him right in his butthole. Right there, uh, he's doing his little sexy pose. And you can get a couple shots in. At this point, after he reaches half health, he charges back and forth three times at you like you just saw right there. He'll charge once, twice, three times, then he'll do this thing where he blows out some ice. It can be interrupted with the magic spell or by hitting him. And here he goes, leaping forward. He does uh, some pretty crazy combos here at the end after his life is halfway taken. So just kind of watch yourself. Make sure you get behind him. When he jumps, roll between his legs. Look how dumb he is. You'll be right behind him and then get him right in the poop shooter. That's what he gets for bending over and sticking his butt up in there. They should have made him twerk a little bit. The one thing you want to watch for is this big sweeping cleave that he does though. You want to roll in the opposite direction. See, he did it. He started off with his right hand and it was on the left side of the screen. You want to roll into that and it shouldn't hurt you. Or you could just avoid it altogether by staying behind him. But make sure you don't get too greedy and try to get too many hits off. Here he is doing a three charge again. All you got to do is just roll three times and he'll do his ice after that. And pretty easy fight, guys. There's going to be some fights coming up that are not this easy. And you're going to have to have lots of technique and strategy. Can't wait for those. I'll be making videos on every single boss. And just like on Dark Souls 2, I'll be doing every single hidden location in the game, every single secret spot, all the weapons, everything you need to know. My channel is all about Dark Souls. Hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, share it with your friends. Love you guys. And remember, stay epic. Look at me, who you thought it was? It's bad news. Pushing weight, stay to stay from me. It's time to bam rules.